All new tonight, a suspicious envelope with a white powder substance taken to a San Antonio substation on the city's northeast side. jones Maltzberger Road was shut down for hours as the hazmat team investigated. That road is now open, but that envelope will be sent for further testing. Eyewitness News reporter Roxy Bustamante explains why police say this was a legitimate suspicious package call. The police substation now open after that suspicious package was deemed non-hazardous. San Antonio police say a man received a suspicious package that was originally delivered in Florida and sent back to sender here in San Antonio. But the problem is the man says he never sent a package to Florida, so he took it to the police substation and that's when the hazmat crews were called in. With what's going on recently, in the United States with the packages that were sent to the Obamas and the Clinton and other staff members. For some reason, this was a package that maybe started on the East Coast and originated here in San Antonio. Being that the political climate had been such, people inside decided to take caution and move away from the package and call people that knew what to do with it before we got the green light and the all clear out here. San Antonio police will now send off that package to find out what exactly was in it. Roxy Bustamante, Kens 5 Eyewitness News.